Good morning, everybody. I'm out here at the chicken coop, and I am going to um, put another packet of the shaved pine, um, pine wood shavings in there. Like I said on the last video, seems a little not cushy enough for them, even though one of them snapped at me yesterday. Another thing I'm doing is I purchased this Chickie's Whiz Dust Bath. It's supposed to be volcanic ash. So if you don't know, most chickens, they walk in the dirt and they bathe. Well, my chickens are in a cage on cement. So that's why I have to put pine shavings and things down. Um, I do have packaged soil, but a lot of the packaged soil you have has, um, that's sold, has like fertilizers and stuff in it. So I don't really think it's good for chicken's fur and skin. Um, what I usually do is wait till I have a packet of soil that's probably like a year old and been used up and depleted of all its nutrients and then I'll put it in a dusting bath. So I have two dusting baths. I have the one in the middle that has the ash in it. And I also add diatomaceous earth to it, okay? Which kills like mites and stuff like that on your vegetables and plants. I don't put a lot, I just mix it in there. And also when I use the old soil, I add diatomaceous earth to it. In fact, I have some old soil in there and I might add a little bit of diatomaceous earth to that because it's dried since for the, since from the last rain. So I'm actually gonna try to do this video showing me um, putting the stuff in the chicken coop. Um, they're whining. First thing I'm going to do is take their little snack bowl I have, put a whole bunch of snacks in it and put it into their coop. So I have a cage and then I have a coop. So I'm gonna put their snacks in the coop so that the chickens can go in there and then I can do what I gotta do. So, um, let's go ahead and get right into doing this, everybody. <laughs>
work a little bit. But I went ahead, I only used probably not even half of that um, bag of pine cones, of pine shavings. <sighs> now it's time for me to do the diatenaceous earth in the, um, in the dusting bath. So I hope I can kept, capture this and show you guys what I do. Okay, hello. <laughs> Let's get this done, you guys. chickens they have a lot of poop and dirt on their feathers I was watching to see why it's so dirty and it's because they're big fluffy chickens they shed their feathers but when they poop the poop just drops down on their feathers so um, dusting is a way that the chickens keep themselves clean after I put the pine shavings in there it feels a lot more fluffy and as soon as I put the pine um, shavings down they start scratching in it so a lot of times I'll throw their snacks in the pine shavings like I'm gonna do in a few minutes because that's what chickens naturally do they scratch um, they hop on everything I really hope you hop down and get in the dusting bath I also put a um, container I hope I caught it on camera a container of that ash in the regular soil so that way they can get it all over their skin and sometimes they'll just sit there and just dust in it and you also see me put some diatonaceous earth in there I'm gonna go back in there and put a little bit more in each of the dusting baths um, I had three but one of the chickens wasn't letting the others bathe in it so I turned it over and now they use it to perch on and they peck on it and things of that nature so it's good to have things in your chicken area for the chickens keep them occupied um, I cannot keep them off of the roof of their coop now I wish I would have had a really big coop um, I clean it off they poop they just they just get up there and they get up there from the um, the um, 
rabbit hutch I had them in when, since they were chicks. They've already broken the door off of that thing. But they still go inside that rabbit hutch sometime just to rest. Sometime they hop on top of the rabbit hutch. So they have torn up the rabbit hutch. Eventually I'm going to have to throw that rabbit hutch away. So that's it. That's the end of this video. I just wanted to show you what I do. Um, I have to do this because my chickens are not on soil. If they were in the grass, the grass would probably be tore up and they would be digging in it and do all kind of stuff. But I don't have them in that natural, unfortunately, in that natural environment because the grass is over there and it's seen by the neighbors. And you can't have unsightly stuff seen by the neighbors. So it's back here in the back. I make sure that they're, I try my best to make sure that they're comfortable and eat healthy. I'm going to start a new batch of um, microgreens for them. And that's it. Oh, one more thing. Even though they're dirty back there, chickens, you will notice they pick at themselves. That's why I put diatomaceous earth in there so they can dust and clean and get mites off of them. But sometimes they'll see each other and they'll pick mites off themselves. That's just what chickens do. So that's it. That's the end of this video. Um, I'm going to wrap it up. And as I always say, please find peace within yourself. Please be peaceable with everyone. I love you all. Have a good day. Bye.